All right, boys, new wipe day on day Z. You already know, I'm playing on the Lab US2, and uh, we're about to pop off, I think. I'm playing solo right now. I don't know if I'm going to play with anybody today. Today's plan, I want to build in the Northeast. Uh, there are some good spots along the Eastern coast that are quiet, that's suitable for a solo to live in. So that's really the plan. So let's just try to get base building stuff. There's like a military base over here, and there's a lighthouse where there's a green key. So I could use my green key card, and uh, we can start progressing. This adventure started off on a completely fresh wipe, and I was one of the first people to hit the eastern coast on the server. And you know I had to go for the green key card, which would give me a yellow key card that I could use further up north. Since I was so ahead of the rest of the pack, I looted the nearby military base near Scalisti Island, and I was able to get a few guns. From there, I made my way up north to a small village called Tolga. So I'll just do a quick little loot run. Grab what we can, and uh, we'll keep heading north, I suppose. Oh, someone's next door. Someone's here. Yeah. Shotgun. I mean, I'll take a shotgun. I stand with Texas is his name. Respect, respect. So from here, I basically continued working my way up north. I didn't really see much except for a fresh spawn that I killed outside of a military base. And from there, I made my way up towards Berezino to hit the yellow key card. Yellow room. What do we get? We got a rifle. Okay. Oh, C4 stick. What the hell? That's kind of big. That's actually kind of big. Uh, so the plan is actually going to be to head north of here, like further north, and live at that fishing village. Because last wipe, I was flying around in a heli, and I saw that there was like a custom uh, lighthouse that somebody else was living in. And I had a pretty cool base, so I'm going to try to secure that as a solo. It might be kind of tricky to do, though. There's the lighthouse. There she blows. Beautiful spot to live at. Nice and quiet. Usually nice and quiet. Lucky for me, I was the first survivor to reach the lighthouse, which meant that it was free for the taking. So I set up a flag and even threw up a door to secure it for the first day of wipe. With the base now up, you guys know I had to go out and do some looting because that's where I was going to get all of the storages and other stuff I would need to maintain this base. And there's a few villages nearby that I went to check out first. Ah, what the fuck was this guy doing over here? Oh, I have no more ammo. Shit. Oh, there's a base here. Oh, crap. All right, we got to loot this guy fast. Because I have half my shit on me. Okay, he actually doesn't have anything except a shotgun. I wonder if this base is actually built up. Should I check it real quick with my shotgun? It's kind of risky, but... Maybe I do a quick little peek in here. See what's going on. Okay, it's not sealed yet, unless they sealed the bathroom. Oh, sleeping bags. Oh, I need these. Nice. Okay, got a sleeping bag for my base. I'm gonna take this one as well. He's hurt. Yeah, some good gear. Oh yeah, this is the guy living here for sure. This sleeping bag would make my life going forward a lot easier, so I made sure to get back to base as soon as I could to place it down. Things were looking okay right now. We had a good amount of supplies, and although there weren't too many doors, this was starting to become something. What I could do is I can try to go to airfield, I guess. I don't really have a gun though. I might want to buy some uh, ammo first, like buy ammo, then go to airfield and try to run red key. No one's run the red key yet from what I've seen. That might be a good bet. Oh, someone just ran it, man. So somebody beat me to it. Oh. Okay, that's... That's like north of here. Let me go see what that is. Could be a base. Oh, yeah, there is a base here, actually. As I was saying that. Because mustache is a common spot. Maybe the shot's coming from here. I see a flag coming out the roof. Is that a... Is this a functional car? They have a car. Oh, I had a lockpick at base. Only if I brought it. I could camp these guys. Try to make a little play if they come out. Frame door open small. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. This isn't even locked. I'm like sneaking up thinking there's somebody in here this whole time. There's not even anybody here. I can literally sit here and just wait. Because he's probably a trader, right? Or getting supplies to build. And considering I don't see anything in here, I know he's going to come back and build eventually. We just got to tuck ourselves in and wait. Someone's running up right now. He cold locked it. No. Oh, 
He locked me in. No. He has a whole inventory on him. Okay, we gotta go. I ripped up his bag, his sleeping bag, so he's not gonna respawn. Oh, he has a lockpick. We can try to steal his car. Alright, did we get in? Uh, no, we failed. Okay, we have one more. Oh, there's a guy. There's a guy. Where are you gonna go, man? He's running left. He must have heard the shots. Yep, there he is. That might be the guy I shot at. So he's definitely flanking around the house, but I just I have a full inventory right now. It doesn't really make sense for me to go fight that because even if I kill him, I can't take his stuff. I have no room. Sometimes in Daisy, you gotta just pull back and take whatever small wins that you can get because being greedy in this game can be a recipe for disaster. Anyways, I got back to base after that ambush and I was able to put up a lot of new storages and items I got off of that guy. And from there, it was time to head back out and continue on with the looting. Those are building a dam base. Whoa, 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 his car. Oh, he must see me, surely. Oh, what the fuck? Is he gonna stop? Please stop. No, he's driving. No, he's not driving. He's not driving. He's gonna stop. Yes. No way, that misses, dude. Does that actually miss? Oh, no, he's gonna be gone now, man. I'm, I kind of missed out on my opportunity, I think. They must have either gone down there or they took the train track. I don't know. Okay, they got out. They definitely got out. I don't know if I killed that guy. I gotta pull back up the hill. I might have killed the other guy. I gotta heal. I mean, I hit his boy with the 308, and then I hit him with like some 556. Five, Their car should be down, down here somewhere though. Anyway, uh, I guess we keep going to Severgrad. I don't know. These guys didn't want to fight. Maybe they couldn't find me, and I looped around. I don't know. Okay, so let's finally run this key. The school is pretty much right in front of us. The main thing I'm hoping to get out of this would be nails. Like, nails is really what I need. And as I say that, someone takes it, okay? Oh my god, they're fast, bro. How do you... How do you loot it that fast? What? Okay, well, they didn't go left. I would have seen them. Must have went this way. They gotta be on the road, surely. Yeah, yeah, it's two guys. Two-man team. Hit one. Hit him again? Oh no, I hit his boy. They may run, fellas. Yeah, they're running. I see them. He's dashing. These guys do not want to fight. I'm only one guy, man. Oh, someone hit a key down here. What the hell? Okay. That's dumb. That's the same guys. Oh my god. They're going to fucking run for it again. One's still in there. One's in there and one's to the left here. I mean, he went over here, but I don't know where he ran. Uh, Where's the guy that I saw run off, though? Is he still in red? I think his teammate just dipped on him. I don't even care. On the way home, I stumbled upon another base only a few hundred meters up the hill from me, and this one was pretty well hidden, and it looked like it was still being constructed. I made sure to mark its location so that I could come back to it later today once I had more free time. I'll sneak up if I can. He's literally right here. Oh, he opened his door. 
No, he went in. He went in his base. They have a drop down. I just heard him drop. They have like fucking seven doors. Floor. Can't do anything about that. Alright, fair enough. He has a lot of gates. Like, he's a gate stack to hell. Unless so we got, like, a gun off him. We got a shitty little helmet, too. I spent the next half hour just looting a nearby village, but I didn't really find anything of importance, and I didn't see or hear a thing. So I just went back to base and grabbed some of my best stuff, and I logged out for the night. Oh. Okay. Well, my base looks like it despawned. <laughs> What the fuck, bro? Alright, I got raided. Oh, man. Everything's gone. No way, dude. That's actually crazy. Just like that, my base was gone overnight. And I wasn't sure if I had gotten raided or if my flag had simply decayed or bugged out. But either way, I had lost a decent amount of stuff. This could have been a lot worse, but I was able to log with most of my valuables. So it wasn't as big of a hit as you might think. I could have simply rebuilt here, but honestly, it wasn't really worth living so far away from the rest of the world. I wanted to be in the central part of the map where I could quickly get into PvP and make money. At this point, my teammates Dexter and Nev logged into the server, which gave me the perfect opportunity to set up a new base location south of Severgrad. Yeah, Fortress would be ideal, actually. That's the easiest one to block off and gate stack, too. A little door on it. Yeah, we'll do this one. This is a good spot. The main reason for building where we did was that most people travel through Severgrad, especially drivers, and setting up here would allow us to pick up a lot of cars. Now my business plan was to actually try and steal cars and sell them to see how much I could make, and it wasn't going to be long until I had my first opportunity to do so. Oh, this car, this car! There's a car like right down the road, dude. Oh, he just fucking drove by, dude. I don't have a scope. That's so free. Oh, maybe I catch him. Please. Where are the odds? I crash and he gets a fucking blockbuster film about to happen. Just a man and his Mosin. Oh, he's still driving. No. He was going to get out when I shot. He was literally going to get out, dude. I killed him! I think I killed him! You gotta be kidding me. Oh my god, he's still going, he's still going. He's not f***ing dead, he tanked it, dude. He tanked the 762. Surely he's got a bandage, right? Oh, I see his car. What is he doing? Killed him. This dude got a full inventory. Car is empty though. Mm. I'm gonna take the parts out of it. Soon after, Dexter logged in, and we heard some gunshots north of our base, and we went to go check it out. Oh, run to extract right now. Yeah. yeah. So let him out. Hit him. Another guy down at the bottom. Who the hell is this guy? He's dead. dead. <laughs> the fuck. I don't think he's dead. I think he's ungone. This guy is juiced. Like purple gear. Like really? hella yellow key cards on him and shit. Oh, he's outside. The bottom. What? Front or back. I hit him, but. He went around the side. The second one on the side. He's like sitting in this, the, in the middle gap on the wall. He can't go. He can't leave unless there's a door there. He's hurt. I hit him once. I hit him once. He's going to close right now. He's going to run around the corner. Oh, he fucking closed it, dude. He's in this middle, like, garage or whatever this is. You want to ego him, all three of us? Oh, I turned, but I missed. He went left. What the fuck? What is that? What is that kid doing? Look oh. at him on the bottom. He's on the bottom. Yeah. I hit him. He's dead. He's dead. What the fuck? The guy stopped the top. I killed him. I'm going to go get your gear. He's going to respawn, though. I just stole another one. Two. Where is the other one in the same, sp same spot? No, I don't know. Bro, he's in red stilted right now. He's like looking up at the apartments. Okay. Got 
dead. Nice. He was like looking around. I don't know what the fuck he's doing. Can you look up at the apartment, somebody? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna looking. look. Ooh, he, hit. he sniped me. I don't know where, uh, what angle he's in. I can't in. even see him, so. These guys weren't leaving their base, and there wasn't much for us to get out of this fight, so we pulled back up the hill towards our own base. For the next few hours, nothing important really happened, and Dexter and Nev ended up logging out, and I was pretty much alone at this point. Oh! I was AFK for a brief period, and during that time, somebody set up a booby trap at my door, and they must have heard it go off, because they came to investigate soon after. Oh, someone's in the house. I just came to check him and chase his ass down. Eh, man, he doesn't have anything crazy. There's some stuff though. It was clear that one of our nearby neighbors wasn't too happy with us living here and he was probably going to start camping us so I made sure to build a bunch of doors downstairs. It wasn't long after that I noticed that there was a King of the Hill event at the nearby Devil's Castle and my buddy Mnix joined the server to tag along and help me capture it. I hear something to my left. It sounds like a, it's a zombie. No, it's a player, 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 player. Near me. You're good? Yeah, 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 I'm fine, but I don't know if it's just like solo or if there's more. Nope. Dead. I'm coming back to you. I got a heal. There could be three, man. That's, that's just two right there. We were able to successfully capture the King of the Hill, and we got some decent stuff out of it, including a nice sniper rifle and some raid components. On the way back home, we stopped by to check out a base that looked like it was improperly built. They had an overlapping roof, and there was a small chance we could actually dismantle it. All right, let's see what this base is talking about, man. Oh, no. All right, let's dive in there. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Oh, they have a car here. Really? Yeah, it's not even locked. By dismantling, we were able to bypass one of the gates, and it looked like there was only one gate left, so I quickly scrambled back to the base to grab a C4 and see if we could get lucky and raid these guys before they patched up their roof. Car, 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 at the church! Just two of them? I think they're gonna stop. I don't have a shot. You're gonna be on them. It's so laggy, dude. Oh, no. They're gone? Yeah. They're resealing. You're lying. Yes, right now. You in? Yeah, 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 yeah. No, you're good, you're good. They have another car, they've got another car. You got the C4? I'm in, yeah. Put the C4 on, go, go, go. <gasps> Ness? I killed them. Just C4, C4. Put the C4 on. Go, go, go. We can at least get their cars, I guess. They're gonna pox, most likely. So just get ready for that. Hold it, hold it. I'm, I have nade. They have a gate right after that. Yeah, their gate stacked. I naded in there. Uh, I'm rep driving past us right now. You're lying. Yep. Where is it? Uh. 75 out our base, yeah. You know dismantling roofs is against the rules on the server. No, it ain't. I'm shooting at him. He's he's zooming now. Oh, he's he's fearless. He's coming towards it. Towards us. He probably took someone off for child. Yeah, I'm gonna spread. I'm gonna spread. Where is he? Right in front of me, dude. I'm dead. You dead? Yeah, I'm dead. There are people here. Uh, this guy's lit, dude. One's dead. Two dead, I mean. He must have dropped people off, like you said. That thing is heavy armored. 
The guys that ambushed us had some high-end armor and guns, and we even got some gunpowder off one of them. As far as the raid went, we didn't want to continue it because we weren't sure how many doors these guys actually had. We had exposed their two cars though, and we wanted to take these, so I grabbed all of the ground loot and took it back to base, and then Mnix and I ran back to try and hijack the cars so that we could sell them later on. Oh, in front of me, actually. A guy running open, over the open field right now. Yeah, yeah. It's two guys. Two good guys. You wanna shoot? Yeah, yeah, let me get a shot. Hold up. Dead? One dead? Nice, 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 nice. One's still in the woods. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big backpack. Yeah, that there's a juicer. He's hit twice. Hit Two three eights. He's not dead. One shot should kill him. Is he dead? He definitely he's, is. He, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good shit, bro. Good shit. They're coming out that base, I think. They come from behind us. Oh, on me. Killed him. I'm going for the guy in the field, bro. I'm looting. Call me greedy, but uh, that's because I'm greedy. Oh, I'm hit. In the forest. I'm, I'm on him. Hold up. Should be dead. No, he's running. He's, I think he's hurt. He's like to the right. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. I've ghost bullets. This is the same guys uh, at that base. I think it's the same dudes. Uh, that's the guy running. Where? Uh, towards west in the forest. Should have headshot at him. Yeah, he's right here. I found him. Oh wow, he's a lot, dude. Like he has good stuff. Like a lot of charcoal. He, oh, oh, homemade, homemade. Can't even fucking talk. Guy in front of me. To your left. To your left. Behind you. Dead. Oh, I'm gonna shot it. He's he's like across at the he's up the hill. Oh no way. I had one, I think. I'm pretty sure. There's yeah, two of them, yeah. two of them. I'm pretty sure I hit one. I think I saw one on the ground. I think I killed one. Yeah, you definitely hit one of blades. Did you double shot? I double shot it, yeah. Might be then dead. Then you should be dead, yeah. This area was still way too hot for us to attempt to steal this car, so we pulled back with the hopes of coming back later on once all the people fighting around this base lost interest. Oh, he's... Okay. Hit him. Nice. Oh. That's from the barn, I think. I'm hit. It's, it's Mosin. Where are they? Uh, yeah. Barn. One is to the right side of the barn. They're in, in the it, forest. or...? No, no. He's dead. Was it the guy wearing blue? Is that him? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, he's dead. Oh, oh I mean... That motherfucker. That that guy was a man with the but he was like camping our door. Hey, this is yeah. the same guy we just killed. He lives here. He lives in this town. After about an hour or so, the fighting died down, and we went back to that base to steal their cars. We were successful in lockpicking them, and they didn't need any major repairs, and we were able to just drive right off. Now, for our business plan, we wanted to sell off as many cars as we could get. But to do that, we would need a place to store all of these vehicles and do one massive sell run to see how much money we could make. Around our base, all of the nice spots were already taken, and it was honestly kind of hectic living where we did, and if we were driving cars around constantly, we'd probably die, so we decided to build somewhere on the east coast, close to one of the car traders. Uh, abort mission. What do you mean? You don't see it? Ah, oh, fuck. Of course, some dudes build a mega compound. Let's keep going, though. See what else there is. Our plan was to build a massive garage at this industrial area north of Solnichny, but as you can see, there's already a massive base in the glass building. As an alternative, we drove down to Solnichny and we found a warehouse right by the water to set up in. All right, here we go. Oh, oh. <gasps> Yo. No, it works. It works. It Go a bit more to the left. Oh, shit. And we have plenty of room under. Damn, this is this is looking good so far, though. I love this. It's a nice setup. 
Now that the garage was complete, we wanted to start collecting as many cards as we could, and to start, we made our way up the northern coast looking for other people's vehicles next to their bases. We were able to quickly find a jeep hidden away in the woods, and we drove that down to the base. Damn, we got another car, boys. That's money right there. There was a lot more people traveling and fighting up north near where our starter base was, so we made our way back up there to try and get some PvP and hopefully find some more cars. Oh, play behind the menu! Where did he come from? A good question. Oh, I see one actually. Police station. Really? Yeah, next to police. Yeah, he's downstairs. Which window? Left. He ran out, I think. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's run out. He's Left running. side. Yeah. I hear footsteps to my right. He's either downstairs or he's upstairs in this room. Oh, I think upstairs. I think I saw him right now. It's either in here or double brown. It could be double brown across the street, too. Hey, someone's running. Outside. I think he's upstairs here, maybe. One dead. Oh, I see one in the field. Where? Oh, yeah. Uh, Freshies, two Freshies running down at 60. They're running towards like the big tech building. Oh yeah, yeah, I see. They're just full naked. I don't know if, what they're doing. One's dead. Someone's sniping, watch out. I'm getting shot. Stop, 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 stop. I don't know, I got shot from a different angle. Like, they either is desync or like I got shot through something because... Oh, I see, I see the sniper, I see the sniper. At the hill. Yeah, I see him. I don't, I don't know how they didn't hit him. He's low. Dead. He's dead. The car, there's a car yeah, too. Yeah, a car, yeah. Ooh, I want that. Not driving anywhere. Okay. The tires are completely ruined. At least yeah. on two. Probably abandoned there from last to restart or something. We found a few cars in the area, but most of them were griefed pretty badly and undrivable, and it wasn't going to be worth repairing them just to sell them later on, so we continued heading further west to look for more. On the way west, we saw that there was an event at the Tizzy military base, so we went over there to see if we could contest that. Oh! Guy in, uh... Police chat, police chat. Yeah, yeah, just pull back. I'm coming. I'm far. I think I killed him. Hey, another, another one next to the police shed. Both dead, both dead. I didn't even hear you shoot. I'm gonna be honest. Is this already looted? Look at it. Oh! Shit, that's 238. Throw it up top. Hold him. Oh, go and cover, go and cover. I'm watching it. I'm watching it. I'm fine. Oh, I see him. He's on the left side of it. He's on the left side of the left side of yeah, the. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hit him dead. The one on on top. Another one. I'm pushing him. Where is he? Behind the barrack. Behind the barrack. Hit him. He's maybe uncon. Oh, he's low, definitely. Is he behind or still or? Behind, behind, behind. Last time I saw him behind. I don't see him. I'm pushing. He's probably healing. He is, he is. He's in the bathroom. Dead. Nice, good shit. Yeah, he hit, hit him for. We got some decent stuff out of him, I guess. Nothing like, nothing crazy, crazy, but. Oh! Blaze, behind us. Two guys, two guys. Left, left, left. left. Hold up, hold up. I'm low, I'm low, I'm low. Another one dead. Nice, nice, nice. Both dead, both dead. Oh, at least I'm getting a lot of 5.56 ammo, which I need. He's low, 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 low. He's behind the tree. Dead. Good shooting, bro. I'm Logan. I'm low, too. Yeah. I'm gonna pop a stem. 
After this fight, we were able to capture a King of the Hill that was on the other side of Tizzy, and from that, we got a black key card, which could give us some really good loot from inside the lab. We had far too much gear to walk all the way down south with, and we stopped at a nearby gas station to pick up a car so that we could drive there instead. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep, keep going. There we go. On the way back to base, we drove by a garage that seemed like it probably would have a car inside, and we went over there to further investigate this to see if it would be worth raiding. Okay. Where'd he go in the... No, no. At the... Bro, so he's dead, so like, so bad. Yeah, it did, it did freeze up right there, I saw that. Oh! Oh! Another one on me! What? About that, I think. There's just an entire three man just like casually sitting here. That, that's a free car. I mean, it's a heavy. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Hey, yo. Oh, yeah. This could be a nice car, dude. I hope it's not a shitty Jeep, dude. Please be an expensive car. Like something nice. Okay. <laughs> oh, wait, wait a minute. No, this one's even worse than the Jeep. Is it? Oh, it's open, though. Ah, okay, we got scammed. I thought it was gonna be like a nice car. Alright, man. You know the drill, take her home. That's another one we could sell. Oh, I'm getting shot at. Shooting. Oh, he's scared. Wait. I just froze so bad. He's running like left, I think. Dead. Oh, just like that? Yeah. Uh, dude, he he has some decent stuff. Nails and shit. With that raid, we were able to add one more car to our collection, and now we had a decent amount of vehicles to sell, but we still wanted to try to get one or two more because we had space for them. While searching for the next vehicle, I wanted to use the black key card we had gotten in Tizzy, and to do that, we would need to enter the lab. I made my way up to the starter base on foot to grab the black key card so we could enter that room and hopefully find some C4 so that we could do a raid. There's a guy up ahead. I could try to kill him here. I don't think he sees me. Oh, there he is. Set the trains. I'm about to cut him off here and kill him. Jeez, that guy was eating, man. What do you have, buddy? Oh, suppressed scar. Wait, this guy's a kitted scar. Oh, he's loaded. What the fuck? Where are they? It's this building here. Think he's in there? Yeah, yeah. Just come out. Yeah. He's not dead. He's dead, he's dead. Okay. Wow, this guy was a looter. Good golly. After this brief fight, we made our way up towards the lab entrance, and it looked like somebody had beat us there by only a few minutes. So going in here was going to be a lot more risky, because we weren't going to be the only people inside. I see a guy across. Coming. I think he sees me. He's at that door right across. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fucking zombie, dude. Is he still in the room? I think so. Oh, on me? Oh, he's so fast. I killed him. I killed one. Me, zombie. You killed one too? Yeah. Okay. This guy's using as well. Oh dear. Here we go. Oh, I forgot the card. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Buddy. C4. I'm made in this one. Sniper case. Go grab the homemade from the one. That one. Oh. Ooh. Legendary helmet. Alright, let's go. 
We need to get a car, man. We need to hit trader. A uh, car front. Get out, get out. Oh! Let me out! Bro, what? My bad. You can't make this shit up. Is he not dead? No! No shot, they're driving. You actually gotta be kidding me. I couldn't even get out the car. Yeah, yeah, he's gone, he's gone. I couldn't even get out the car. You, you didn't, did you hit him? Yeah. He's coming back. I'm gonna ram him. I think we're faster, maybe. He's just driving in the field. Oh, uh, he probably let someone out. Watch out. He did let somebody out. Told you. I can't aim. I'm dead. That car is invincible. He's dead. What do these guys even have, man? They're literally fresh, like they have nothing. I met back up with Mnix near our base and he told me that our nearby neighbors shot another driver on the road and the car was just sitting there for the taking. Watch out, left windows open. <laughs> he's, he's peeking at? Yeah. Uh, what the f is this guy? I don't know. Okay, I'm murdered. I'll just uh, back it out if you want to cover. Yeah, yeah. They they murdered this guy most likely. Oh, they just keep driving. I'm gonna walk. One's one's approaching right now. Oh yeah, see see. He saw me. This is one of them. He's running. Oh, watch out. Window open. Left. Should be dead. I double shot him in the head. He's definitely, he's definitely gonna be on timer, I think. At this point, we had a good amount of C4 and we wanted to use it on a worthwhile target, but we wouldn't have enough to raid that base that we were just fighting at, so we had to try to find somebody else. While looking for targets, Mnix mentioned that earlier on this morning, he had gotten into a fight with one of the groups that lived further north of us near Berezino. He told me that they had talked some shit to him, and I'll just show you his clip so you can see exactly what happened. Wait, nah, imagine having a base though, you fucking suck, little bro. Get some friends, get some pussy, please. Because of that situation, we decided to take the gamble and raid these guys, hoping that we had enough C4 to get through all of their gates. Okay, it's just two doors then. Right, yeah, no three doors, but we're good. Alright, let's see. Profit, profit. Okay, okay. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, chat. Wait, they're actually fucking loaded, dude. Look down here. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, bunch of nails. Like a bunch what? of nails. Yeah. How do you have all these nails and you don't build, man? For only having three doors, these guys were pretty stacked. We got everything from expensive barter goods to high-end guns and armor. The one thing we didn't find was C4, but either way, we packed up our bags with almost everything of value and we got right out of there. So far, we had accomplished everything we wanted to and the last thing left to do was to sell off all of the cars we had collected and see how much money we would make. 
So this beauty, the Jeep, sells for 160k. That's good, dude. 120k? <laughs> yeah, it's there you go. Another 80k for me. Oh, whoa! Last car is officially sold, man. That's beautiful. Okay, first the small, yeah. This here. Oh, wow, the nails too. Okay, okay. And all the money. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, let me add my money to it then. Off of the car selling business, we had made around seven to 800,000 and the rest was made from PVPing and raiding. Although it was profitable, I don't think selling cars is the most efficient way of making money, at least not on the server. If we had more time to play and could collect around 30 cars, we would have made a fortune, but in this case, it made more sense to just raid and PVP to make money that way. Anyways, we had made around 4 million so far and we had absolutely nothing to really spend it on, so we made our way towards the trader Got to it. try and help out a new player. What's your base looking like? Do you like you stacked or are you just like you getting by? Uh, I'm getting by just now. Like, uh, um, I, I, I'm trying to do key cards. So, like, I just go from green to yellow and then I kill myself in my base and go back to green to yellow. Alright, man. How, come with me. Come with me. Come with us. Bro. Don't, uh, don't go out in the safe zone and lose shit. this, though. Don't get killed out there. Take it back to base. Oh my god! <laughs> Is he screaming? How, how do I? Oh, I just wear the I bag just, if you I, want. I, I, just wear the bag, yeah. Jeez. I'm gonna be doing that, and I really appreciate that. Yeah, bro, no worries. Yeah, no worries, man. Well, um, yeah, man. I hope you make it back and to base in one piece. That yeah, we're gonna head off now, but uh, good luck in your adventures. I love you guys. This, this is amazing. Yeah, no worries, man. Ah, no worries. And that pretty much concluded our adventure on the Lab US2. I think later on I'll try to do a proper car dealership business where I sell cars to other players, but that might be a little tricky to set up, so we'll see. Anyways, if you guys made it to the end, I appreciate you all for watching like always, and I'll catch you in the next adventure.